guys, welcome back to my channel. I hope you're all doing well. And if you're new here, my name is Nishita. I would love for you guys to subscribe and give this video a thumbs up if you like it. In today's video, I'm going to do a review and swatches of the new Huda Beauty uh, Demi Matte Liquid Lipsticks. Uh, she released about 15 of them and I got all of them to do swatches for you guys. Uh, to be honest, I've never tried any of Huda Beauty products before. I don't know, for some reason, I just never tried them because they're all uh, mostly she released like uh, lip products before and they're like each 20 bucks so I usually don't spend that much on my lip products and the foundation that she came out with I mean the, of the reviews that I've seen it seems to be a thick foundation and it's highly scented I kind of have sensitive skin so I don't like uh, like to try foundations that are really thick and has a strong scent to them so that's why I've never tried any of her products before uh, but I want to try out the Demi Matte uh, liquid lipsticks because these days I've been into uh, lipsticks that are not drying. Uh, recently I've tried out the NYX lip lacquers and I really like them. I mean few of the colors at least. Uh, they're not completely matte, they have the satin finish and I just love to use them as lip toppers once I'm done uh, like applying my lipstick. So I wanted to try these out as well. And few of the colors online at least seem uh, pretty appealing to me. Now I'm gonna jump into the swatches and show you all the 15 colors and I'm gonna pick one color, wear it for the rest of my day. And once the lipstick wears off, I'm gonna give you guys my thoughts on the lipsticks and tell you guys if it's worth it or not because each of these retails are $20. Let's talk a little bit about the packaging. Uh, when you, this contains like a plastic container like this and when you uh, open one side of it, uh, you can slide out the box that actually holds the lipstick in it. To be honest, this seems to be a little bit extra and I don't know if I like it uh, because it, it seems like a hassle to get the lip product out. If I'm gonna get through all the 15 products, it's gonna take me a really long time just to get the lip product out of it. So let's jump into the swatches now.
those are the swatches of a 14 Huda Beauty a Demi Matte uh, liquid lipsticks. I thought I had 15 of them, but I accidentally ordered two of the same color. Uh, so I ended up doing only 14 uh, color swatches. Uh, coming to the formula itself, uh, the formula is really impressive actually. Um, all of them are really opaque. Uh, one swipe and it covers your entire lips but there were few of them which are a little bit you know patchy but you can layer them pretty well like once you go over like two to three times it covers your entire lips it doesn't go on streaky or anything like that and the finish wise it's definitely is a satin finish it's not like it doesn't dry down to a completely matte that is for sure but at the same time it's not overly glossy uh, when you you know, uh, like, uh, kiss your hands a little bit, uh, shininess goes away, but it doesn't look, you know, completely matte. Uh, I really like that. I mean, I really like the finish of these lipsticks. One more thing that I really loved was the applicator. Uh, as you can see, it has a, you know, uh, inclined edge and that makes it really easy to apply the product to line your lips when you're applying it. Uh, I really like the applicator as well. So far, I like the finish. I like the formula. So I don't know how long it's going to last on my lips. Uh, I'll wear this for the rest of my day and see how long the, you know, liquid lipstick wears on its own. Uh, so I'll see you in a few hours. But guys, it's been almost six hours since I've uh, had this uh, lipstick on. I did have my lunch, though I haven't eaten any greasy food or anything like that. I did have my lunch and the lip product is still on there. Uh, it is pretty long wearing but one thing I want to mention is that it definitely is bleeding around my mouth so I would highly recommend and insist that you use a lip liner if you are planning on purchasing these lip products uh, and one more thing that I want to mention is that if you want to pick few colors from this range definitely stick with the more nude colors uh, because I personally would prefer my bold lip colors to be matte so that they don't move around much. Few of the, you know, nude colors are pretty good and they complement my skin really well. So if you're closer to my skin tone, uh, you can find really good nude colors in this range. But if you pair it with the right lip liner, it's gonna look super pretty. As you can see, just transferred as I was talking to you guys. So definitely stick with the more nude colors with this range. And one more biggest pro about this lip product is that it's not gathering in the inner corners of my lip. Usually when I ha wear lip products and if I talk a lot and if my lips go dry, they definitely like goop up uh, in my inner corners and it looks like really disgusting. But with this lip product, I did not notice that though I was like, you know, constantly uh, talking today, I did not notice that. So all in all, the formula is uh, really good. Uh, it's just that you have to use a lip liner and I would highly highly recommend you to uh, stick with the more nude colors in this uh, product line. So that completes this video. I hope this video was helpful. Thank you so much for watching. Please subscribe if you haven't already and also give this video a thumbs up if you like lip swatches videos. So hit the bell so you don't miss out on any of my uploads. I'll see you all in my next one. Bye!